beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. You may now be seated in the presence of the Lord. Now, the first scripture um, I just read talked about um, having dominion um, in the earth. And a lot of people don't know that once they receive Jesus in their heart and are filled with the Spirit of God, they've been actually given dominion and authority on the earth, but they haven't been taught how to use it. So I'm going to demonstrate that um, by having um, Aaron come up right now. And I'm going to show you how you have dominion of the, over the earth, over things, over uh, body parts, over your life. And all you have to do is walk in it and take authority in it. And you will have everything that God has created you to have and to walk in. Okay? Aaron, I want you to come over here on this side. And I want you to turn this way. And I want you to put your hands in front of me. Put your hands in front of me. Put them together. Okay, can everybody see that his arms are pretty much even, right? They look pretty even to you? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm just going to release the power of God in his, in his arms. Father, in the name of Jesus, I just release the anointing of God in his arms in Jesus' name. Father, I just release the anointing of God down his neck in Jesus' name. And Father, I release the anointing of God down his um, right arm in Jesus' name. Okay. Now you see how it just shot out? You see that? Mm -hmm. So now that we got to turn this way. So now it's two different. See how it's different now? Mm -hmm. You see that? Mm -hmm. I speak to the left arm and I command it to grow. 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 Jesus' name, grow. Grow. Grow again. Grow two more inches. In Jesus' name, grow. 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 You see that? <gasps> grow. Stop. Now, you, everybody see that? Mm -hmm. That's that same power that you can walk in. Not only for the fish and the sea, the birds in the air, um, but over your body. You can speak to your body and tell your body to do well. You can command money to come to you. Now, watch this. I'm going to tell it to go back two inches. Right arm. Retract two inches. Retract. 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 Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. You see that? Go back. Two more inches. Right arms. Go back. Go back. Go back. You see it? Go back. Go back. Go back two inches. Go. Go back. Retract. 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 Go back. Retract. 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 Some more. See it? Y'all see that? So whatever you speak to has to obey you when you have Jesus in your heart. Now I'm going to tell it to come back up again. I'm just, I'm just showing this as an example so the church can walk in the fullness of God. Um, God doesn't have to talk to you and tell you to release his love and his power. Because anytime you release his power for somebody, you know, that's an act of God's love. And it's wrong for the church to have the power of God inside of them and walk past people who are sick. All you have to do is stop and ask them if they want prayer. And then all you have to do is pretend, uh, uh, not, uh, all you have to do is practice. It's like riding a bike. You practice releasing the power. Now watch this. <sighs> See how it grew back out? I'm gonna roll it, I'm gonna blow on the other one. Grow. Left arm. Left arm grow. One more inch. Grow. 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 